Hey everyone, what we're going to do today is we have two liquids. We're at a point where we're thinking about what is happening with water and with other liquids and why do some things, why do some liquids evaporate faster or, or dry up faster than water and, and what are some other properties that we can observe. So I have here acetone and I have water. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put drops onto wax paper. So I'm going to see if I can get this here. This is water first. So water, go ahead and put this on here. And I don't know if you can see that, but let's see if I can bring it closer. But you can look at the water drop and how that, you know, if I put a drop of water on here, what do you notice? You see the kind of the shape of the drop, okay? You see the shape of the drop is pretty rounded like that, and it's kind of moving around. If I move it around, it, it kind of, you know, slid a little bit. Now this is acetone. So acetone is next, and I'm going to put acetone on this side here, and let's take a look and see what happens. So well, you can see here, it's quite a bit different. Do we have that same pattern, that same shape? I don't think so. It's, it's, it's on here. So if you look, if you look carefully, you can see it's, it's on here but the shape of it is a lot different. So you can see that this is you know, very flat, whereas this, this is a more of a rounded drop. So that's one thing is why does that happen? The other experiment we're gonna do is we're gonna take a penny, so two pennies here, and we're gonna put the same side, this is, we're gonna do water on this side here. So remember these drops are water. I'm gonna go ahead and put some water onto the penny and see what happens. And how many, let's see, can we do this? So if I go drop like this, one, two, three. The question is, how many drops can I fit on here? Okay, so you can count how many drops I got on there before it spilled over. What about acetone? If I look at acetone, and notice the shape of the water as I did that. It got to be, if you want to rewind this video, go back and look at the shape of the dome on top of the, the penny. And now if I look at acetone, let's see what happens. Look at the shape, how different it is. And now it's already off. So it, I, you can't really see that, but you can see the shape is a lot different. I'm gonna put some more water back on this penny. Let me dry this off a little bit so it gets. So water again, you can see the acetone shape is much different. I'm just gonna go Okay, so I'm just gonna stop there, but you can see this one has acetone on it. This one has water on it. Look at the shape difference. How much different is that? So why is that happening? What's going on with the water? What's going on with the acetone? And think about the attractions between the molecules. What does that tell us about the, the strengths of the attractions between the molecules of each liquid?